Chapter 51 I'm Patrick Starr you are listening at NovelFull.audio. Chapter 51 I'm Patrick Starr The night was dark. Luo Rixu and Imo Yuan were assigned to the first team and were currently patrolling outside the germinal base. During this period of time, Mo Yuan had also advanced to the fifth realm. However, he only used one experienced advancement material. The other four were all ordinary advancement materials. He could not advance perfectly like Lin Xian. Brother Luo, is something big about to happen here? Why did they suddenly increase the mission quota and make the logisticians speed up the forging of equipment and medicinal potions? They even increased the patrol strength and even let fifth realm martial artists like us come out to patrol. Do you know anything about this? Tell me, Mo Yuan whispered. Mo Yuan had long sensed the increasingly anxious atmosphere in the germinal base and vaguely felt that something was wrong. He wanted to ask manager number three, but manager number three only told him to mind his own business and did not say anything. However, he felt that since Luo Rixu was the martial artist manager number three valued the most, he definitely knew a lot of secrets. Luo Rixu smiled smugly. You didn't guess wrong. There's indeed a big matter. Mo Yuan pressed, what is it? Luo Rixu whispered, the three managers have already reached an agreement to attack White Crane Town. Hiss, Mo Yuan gasped and instinctively said, but the construction division is so powerful. Aren't we overestimating ourselves by attacking them? Luo Rixu berated unhappily, idiot. Although the construction division is currently the largest organization in Asia, being large also means that their defensive line is very long. Mo Yuan immediately reacted. Do you mean that the construction division doesn't have the energy to support White Crane Town? Luo Rixu nodded slightly. Lord Number 3 already told me that they have received internal news that the number and level of the demon beasts that surged out of the Drowning City Mystic Realm has increased. The construction division has mobilized a large number of high-dot-end and mid-level forces to deal with the situation in the coastal areas. Even the martial artists of the White Crane Town have been mobilized. A seventh realm martial artist and several sixth realm martial artists were mobilized to leave, and their current defense is rather weak. Mo Yuan's eyes lit up. This is our chance to prove ourselves. Luo Rixu smiled smugly. That's right. Later, when the time comes, the first to attack White Crane Town and the first to rush to the Mystic Realm's Door of Light will definitely receive great re. Before he could say the word, rewards, he suddenly saw a flame appear in the distance. Dot immediately after, a faint demon wail sounded. Luo Rixu suddenly became solemn. Something's wrong. He waved his hand, and Mo Yuan immediately followed closely. The two of them quickly arrived at the scene of the accident. When they arrived, they only saw flames and charcoal on the ground. Among the more than a hundred demon beasts, the weakest was at the first realm, and the strongest was at the fourth realm. However, they were all instantly killed and did not even have the chance to escape. Luo Rixu squatted down and saw the charred marks left by the fireball hitting the ground with a solemn expression. He could tell that the fireball was more than two meters in diameter. If it smashed into a person, who knew what the consequences would be? Mo Yuan smacked his lips incessantly. This is bad, someone's causing trouble. Luo Rixu nodded. The three managers had just ordered for the location of the nearby demon beast groups to be marked. However, on the same night, a demon beast group had been slaughtered. Moreover, not a single one was left. Someone must have known about this and deliberately caused trouble. At this moment, he saw flames appear in the distance. Go back and report. I'll chase after him and investigate. Luo Rixu was suddenly excited. Mo Yuan frowned slightly, but he still nodded and immediately returned to the base. Luo Rixu licked his lips and rushed towards the flames. As number three's most valued martial artist, he naturally knew the use of these demon beasts. The Germinal organization planned on using them to attack White Crane Town. 
In that case, the identity of the person who caused trouble was self-evident. It was very likely someone from the construction division. If he could capture the other party alive, it was very likely that they could obtain a lot of information from the other party. If he succeeded, it would definitely be a meritorious deed. He naturally had to monopolize such a huge opportunity and directly sent him O.U. on away. This guy only knows how to cause trouble in the dark. He definitely doesn't have the guts. I can easily take care of him. Luo Rixu was smug and felt extremely smart about his decision just now. Soon, he rushed to the flames. There was still no one there, only flames and a ground of charred corpses. Luo Rixu was even more smug. He doesn't dare to face me at all. He must be very afraid of me. I have to quickly capture him so that I can go back and claim credit. He continued to chase after the flames in the distance, as if he was chasing after a huge treasure. Lin Xian casually used his fireball to directly kill more than a hundred demon beasts. Then, he used his fireball to kill the dozen or so fifth realm demon beasts that were still alive. Sensing the figure that rushed over from behind, he shook his head slightly. I only came out to clean up the demon beasts. I didn't even want to fight you, but you insisted on chasing me alone. Why do you have to court death? Lin Xian quietly hid in the black shadow and waited for this unlucky person. Soon, Luo Rixu rushed over. He still saw the quietly burning flames and the charred corpses on the ground. However, he did not see the figure from before. This guy sure is fast on his feet. Wait, why can't I see the flames this time? Luo Rixu looked around and discovered that it was pitch black everywhere. Because I'm behind you. A sharp voice suddenly sounded. The next moment, Luo Rixu felt a blazing high temperature ignite on his back. Boom. The terrifying flame explosion had erupted recently and directly burned his entire back to ashes. The pain instantly engulfed Luo Rixu's nerves. At this moment, he almost fainted from the pain. Boom. Before he could take out the life potion from the storage compartment and use it, another flame explosion appeared again and smashed fiercely into the back of his head. Luo Rixu's health points flew down by 3,000 feet and were instantly cleared. Before dying, he saw a figure enveloped in a cloak with flames burning in his palm. The feeling this figure gave him was even more terrifying and powerful than Shield Ghost back then. I want to see, his face. Who is he? Luo Rixu forced himself to look up and saw, a Patrick Star mask. You didn't expect this, did you? I'm Patrick Star. Luo Rixu. Crash. After Luo Rixu died, the items in his storage compartment directly fell to the ground. Lin Xian placed them all into his consciousness space, not leaving behind a single one. If you had a collar on your neck, I would still have some qualms. Unfortunately, you don't. Lin Xian smiled faintly. The collars worn by the Wasteland Reclaimers would record their deaths. For example, Lu Luo could find out the cause of Sun Jigua's death. Of course, this was not impossible to deal with. As long as he destroyed the Wasteland Reclaimer's collar before killing them, there would naturally be no records left. After becoming a Sixth Realm Martial Artist, Lin Xian could already see the information on the collar on his neck. This was a Seventh Realm Curse Equipment. There were two ways to get rid of the collar. The first was for one to advance to the Third Realm and the collar would naturally be removed by the manager. The second was to forcefully blast it open. With Lin Xian's current ability, he was already able to blast it open directly. However, it was still too early for him to make a move. Half an hour later, when Mo Yuan and the other Fifth Realm martial artists searched here with difficulty, they only saw a charred corpse. Luo Rixu's Charred Corpse Chapter 52 Something Big is Going to Happen You Are Listening at Novel Full Audio. Chapter 52 Something Big is Going to Happen Bang. Manager number 3 punched the table fiercely. The cup swayed from side to side and fell to the ground. 
After just one patrol, the martial artist he valued the most had died outside for no reason. Mo Yuan had a nervous expression. Judging from the situation of the scene, the person who killed Brother Luo is someone skilled in fire magic. Brother Luo was almost instantly killed and could not resist. Moreover, this person was the same person who killed a large number of demon beasts along the way. After hearing Mo Yuan's description, the scene he saw in Whitewater City not long ago suddenly appeared in Manager Number Three's mind. On an abandoned street, there was a charred tiger corpse. The killer of that tiger was also proficient in fire magic and was able to get the job done with one hit. Could it be the same person? Take me to the place where he died, manager number three growled. Mo Yuan nodded repeatedly. Wait, call number two along, number three said. A moment later, Mo Yuan led number two, number three, and black to the place where Luo Rixu had died. Even after more than two hours, the smell of burning still lingered here. Judging from the burn marks on the ground, the spell used was far more intense than fireball. Clearly, they were higher dot level and higher dot level fire spells. As a level 9 sixth realm martial artist who was well dot versed in elemental magic, number two could tell at a glance that this was the mark left by flame explosion. Manager number three's pupils constricted. They were identical. This scene was very similar to the tiger corpse he had seen in Whitewater City that day. Number two also exclaimed softly, this scene looks familiar. Number three took a deep breath. It's identical to the scene in Whitewater City. It must be that person. You even said that he's only a lone wolf and won't threaten the germinal organization. Number two coughed lightly. There's still a difference. A difference. This time, the other used flame explosion, not fireball. Manager number three. Manager number two also did not expect that the lone wolf would appear again and even kill a core member of the germinal organization. Moreover, although number two was secretly glad that Luo Rixu had died, he really did not know who the murderer was. Number two turned to look at Black, who shook his head, indicating that he did not know either. The four of them finally returned and named the murderer, Flame Explosion. Flame Explosion. The next day, all the martial artists ate breakfast in the cafeteria of the germinal base. Before they even left the mystic realm, the announcement of the germinal base was announced. Last night, an outsider with the code name, Flame Explosion, attacked the demon beasts wandering outside the base and killed the captain of the Demon King team, Luo Rixu, with a sneak attack. As long as anyone can provide information regarding this flame explosion, they will immediately be rewarded with 500,000 general coins and a precious purple equipment. The announcement sounded, and all the martial artists were shocked. The captain of the Demon King team, Luo Rixu, was actually killed by an outsider. Lin Xian also heard this broadcast from his single room and immediately cursed. Flame Explosion This code name is so much worse than Shield Ghost. Do they know how to come up with names? He curled his lips. The rewards offered by the three managers were indeed enviable. Instantly, a large number of clues surged, but all of them were fake. Only after Yan Wei directly killed a few refugees who were fabricating clues did this reckless behavior gradually calm down. Of course, in the end, they could not find any clues. This was because other than Lin Xian, no one had seen flame explosion before. The night was dark. Lin Xian changed into his cloak and jacket again and entered the wilderness. This time, he planned to kill all the more powerful demon beasts in one go. The remaining first realm and second realm demon beasts were useless. The defensive strength of White Crane Town could easily kill such a weak demon beast. In an abandoned house on the east side of the germinal base, Mo Yuan looked at the young man with a sour face in front of him with an uneasy expression. The young man was naturally manager number three. He had changed into an ordinary set of equipment and looked no different from Mo Yuan and the other martial artists at first glance. Sir, will flame explosion still appear tonight? 
Mo Yuan could not help but ask. Number three said indifferently, Do you doubt me? Mo Yuan shuddered and shook his head repeatedly. No, no. I'm just worried that if he doesn't come, won't you have made a wasted trip and wasted your time? Number three said, He killed fifteen demon beasts last night. They're all north of East Lake City. However, there are still many demon beasts in the east and south of East Lake City. Among them, there's no lack of demon beasts led by Fifth Realm and Sixth Realm demon beasts. He'll definitely appear tonight. With a 50% chance, do you think I won't be able to find him? Soon, Number 3 changed his equipment and changed from a young man with a sour face to a stubble man. From now on, I'm an ordinary Fifth Realm martial artist. You can just call me third brother. Mo Yuan nodded. Yes, third brother. The two of them walked out of the abandoned house one after another and took over the patrol mission of the previous fifth realm martial artists. The last batch of fifth realm martial artists in charge of patrolling included Lu Luo and Wen Xiong. Lu Luo was too lazy to speak. Wen Xiong nodded at Mo Yuan as a form of greeting. Mo Yuan coughed lightly. Next, it's our turn to take over. The two of you, go and rest. Lu Luo's gaze suddenly became sharp as she stared coldly at manager number three. Who is this person? I know every single fifth realm martial artist. When Xiong immediately put on his gloves and entered a combat state. Could it be a spy from the construction division? Manager number three. Mo Yuan did not know whether to laugh or cry. He whispered, it's manager number three. Lu Luo berated on the spot, stop speaking nonsense. Why should I believe you? Use your observer skill to take a look. Manager number three was also helpless. He did not know if he should be happy or ashamed to encounter such a responsible patrolman like Lu Luo. Lu Luo used her observer skill and froze on the spot. Wen Xiong also used his observer skill. However, afterwards, his eyes became even more vigilant. All I can see are a bunch of question marks. You're definitely a spy. Number 3. Lu Luo coughed lightly. Sorry, we mistook you for a spy from the construction division. It's our fault. She hurriedly left with Wen Xiong. Manager number three had deliberately disguised himself like this. It was definitely not for no reason. Something bad was about to happen. After walking for a distance, Lu Luo looked back and watched as number three and Mo Yuan's figures were drowned in the darkness. Her heart skipped a beat. If nothing unexpected happened, Shield Ghost would also go out to chase away the demon beasts tonight. It was very likely that he would encounter number three. Number three was a level nine sixth realm martial artist, and Shield Ghost had just advanced to the sixth realm. The difference between their attributes was at least 72 points. Lu Luo's expression did not change, but she was actually anxious. However, she did not have a way to contact Shield Ghost. At this moment, she could only wait. Sister Lu Luo, let's go to the canteen to eat. My treat. Wen Xiong smiled honestly. Lu Luo shook her head. I have something to tell Sir Number Two. I won't eat first. With that said, she hurriedly ran towards Manager Number Two's office. In the office, she quickly found Manager Number Two, who was working diligently. Lu Luo's knocking immediately alarmed Number Two. After wiping the sparkling saliva from the corner of his mouth, number two opened the office door calmly. Sir, there might be a huge problem. Lu Luo's expression was solemn. Chapter 53 Fighting Manager Number 3 You are listening at Novel Full. Audio. Chapter 53 Fighting Manager Number 3 Manager Number 2 was stunned. Lu Luo had always been a calm person. Why did she suddenly say that something bad was going to happen? Xiao Lu, this isn't good. You shouldn't panic no matter what, 
number three has disguised himself as a patrolman and entered the wilderness. He might encounter shield ghost. Manager number two was shocked and stood up immediately. Damn. There's going to be a huge problem. Seeing that he was also so anxious, Lu Luo was even more anxious. How powerful is number three? Will shield ghost be able to escape from him? Number two sighed lightly. When number three advanced to the first realm, second realm, third realm, fourth realm, and fifth realm, he used five experienced advancement materials every time to advance perfectly. Only when he advanced to the sixth realm did he use four experienced advancement materials and one ordinary material. Other than that, he has at least five peerless golden skills, four peerless golden equipment, and three peerless golden rune groups. With that said, Lu Luo's heart turned cold. If the other party was such a powerful level 9 sixth realm martial artist, it was useless no matter how high Shield Ghost's constitution and defense were. I only hope that Shield Ghost won't encounter number 3. Number 3's agility is extremely high. Once he discovers Shield Ghost, he will definitely be able to catch up to him, manager number 2 frowned deeply. How should we help Shield Ghost? Are we just going to watch? Number two paced back and forth. Go and get black first. We'll rush to the wilderness and find an excuse to intercept number three. Lu Luo was puzzled. Then should we get black? Number two. I can't beat number three. Lu Luo. She hurriedly rushed to the black single dormitory and kicked open the door only to find Black lying on the ground with a huge pile of empty vodka bottles beside him and half a bottle of vodka in his hand. A long stream of sparkling saliva dripped from Black's mouth as he snored loudly. However, even though he was drunk, his entire body was still wrapped in Black, and only his chin was exposed. Lu Luo hurriedly stepped forward and shook him awake. Shield Ghost is in danger. Number 2 asked me to get you. Quickly go to the wilderness. Black did not react. Lu Luo was already experienced with waking people up. She directly picked up the half bottle of vodka in Black's hand, opened Black's mouth, and poured it into his mouth. His black eyes opened immediately. He was energetic and did not seem to be drunk at all. Let's go. Black grabbed Lu Luo's hand and rushed out. In the wilderness. Lin Xian casually used a flame explosion skill. With a bang, the entire demon beast horde below the fourth realm instantly disappeared. The dozens of demon beasts above the fourth realm were also severely injured by this attack and wailed endlessly. Lin Xian casually used another flame explosion and easily killed them. It sure is good to harvest effortlessly like this. Lin Xian followed the map and rushed to the next region where the demon beasts roamed. The map only indicated an approximate location. After all, this was the real world. It was impossible for the demon beasts to stop at one place and not move. They also had to forage for food, excrete, and mate. However, when he arrived, Lin Xian saw two figures passing by. Just like Luo Rixu and Lin Xian last night, these two people were clearly on patrol. One of them was Imo Yuan, and Lin Xian did not know who the other person was. He recalled the information regarding all the fifth realm martial artists that Number 2 had provided him and suddenly discovered that he had never seen a fifth realm martial artist who looked like this germinal organization. However, it was also possible that the other party was a fifth realm martial artist who had just advanced from the level 9 fourth realm. It was normal for him not to know him. Lin Xian did not take this matter to heart. Since these two people had not discovered him, he did not plan to make a move. There was no need for him to attract the attention of the germinal organization. It would be better for him to kill the demon beasts in the wilderness secretly. Last night, Luo Rixu was simply poking a bear with a stick. Moreover, that person was also an expert subordinate working underneath manager number three. The earlier he was killed, the better. However, just as Lin Xian was about to let those two off, the bearded man's eyes suddenly flashed with a sharp light. 
he suddenly pulled out his two swords from the storage compartment and pierced through the 100-meter distance like a sharp knife through the night, directly heading for Lin Xian's back. Lin Xian's perception quickly discovered this figure that was quickly approaching. He immediately used the fire ring technique. The main advantage of fire ring technique was not its damage, but its ability to instantly repel all enemies. Oh this was also one of the few skills fire mages could use to protect themselves. The flames quickly illuminated Lin Xian and number 3. Boom! The flames directly burned past number 3. However, contrary to Lin Xian's expectations, he failed to push the other party more than 10 meters away. Instead, he only pushed the other party more than 5 meters. 5 meters could be crossed in the blink of an eye for a level 9 6th realm master like manager number 3. The sharp blade stabbed into the soft cloak craftily. Then, Lin Xian was sent flying back by an even greater force. Under the cloak was not a weak body, but an even stronger armor. Number 3 was dumbfounded. In this instant, Lin Xian retreated more than 10 steps and used his observer skill on the other party. Only by knowing oneself and the enemy could one formulate a battle plan. Lin Xian was not a rash person who only knew how to erect a huge shield. Name Manager Number 3 Level Level 9 Sixth Realm Experience 9 Billion Slash 9 Billion Attributes 99 Constitution, 121 Strength, 101 Spirit, 389 Agility Skill Bloodthirsty Assault, Peerless Golden, High Dot Level Critical Hit Mastery, Peerless Golden, Shadow Assassination, Dot, Wind Walk, Dot, Observer, Dot Equipment Poison Frost Blade Peerless Golden, Shadow Assault Set, Peerless Golden, Agility Ring, Dot, Strength Ring, Dot. Lin Xian was shocked. Damn, this person was manager number three. Coupled with manager number three's disguise, he quickly understood the reason. Manager number three had disguised himself as a patrolman only to capture, flame explosion. Moreover, number three's attributes, skills, and equipment were all very impressive. Just this 389 points of agility was enough to make any level 9 6th realm martial artist with low attack health tremble in fear. Lin Xian's constitution was only 353 points now, and it was much inferior. Agility increased critical hit chance, critical damage, attack speed, movement speed, dodging, and perception. This meant that even without using any equipment, manager number 3 had an extremely high critical hit chance. In addition, number 3 also had the peerless golden grade advanced critical hit mastery, which provided an additional 30% critical hit chance. That attack just now directly made me lose more than 300 health points, almost one dot third of my health points. Ever since he transmigrated, Lin Xian had never lost so much health before. Moreover, the attack just now also carried the negative effects of poison and shrouding frost. Clearly, it was caused by the two poison frost blade. In a poison state, one's health would continue to decrease. In the case of shrouding frost, one's movement speed would decrease. However, under the enhancement of Lin Xian's extremely high resistance, the duration and potency of these two negative statuses decreased quickly and soon disappeared. Chapter 54 Take this Flame Explosion Technique, Increase by 145% You are listening at Novel Full Audio. Chapter 54 Take this Flame Explosion Technique, Increase by 145% Lin Xian was very shocked. However, Manager Number 3 was even more shocked when he saw the Patrick Star mask under the other party's cloak. Shouldn't this flame explosion be a mage who used fire magic? Moreover, according to manager number 2's analysis, this person's spirit and agility were very high, so it was impossible for him to have a constitution that was also very high. How could a mage who relied on fire magic to attack spend his precious points on constitution? Moreover, 
given that he himself had high agility in peerless golden skills, equipment, and runes, he was originally filled with confidence. He believed that even if he could not instantly kill Flame Explosion, he would still be able to kill it eventually. He did not expect the other party to actually block his attack. From the looks of it, the other party did not seem to be injured at all. Even his poison frost blade had not been able to cause the other party to enter a poison or frost state. Why, number three could not figure it out. It had been proven that when a person doubted himself, he would become hesitant. Manager number three did not continue to chase after the other party. Instead, he chose to use his observer skill as well. However, even Black had not been able to see through Lin Xian's attributes back then. His observer skill was only precious purple and its level was even lower than Black's observer skill. Naturally, he was unable to see all the information. He could only see a few attributes, a few skills, and equipment, but not even their grades. Not far away, Mo Yuan, who was hiding behind a rock, saw this scene with his own eyes. He was shocked and speechless. Manager number three was simply a god-like existence in his eyes. Any demon that number three attacked would instantly die. Back then, when the demon beasts from the drowning city Mystic Realm attacked the germinal organization from the lake, if manager number three was also there, Black would not have been able to take all the credit. However, despite being so powerful, manager number three's sharp double swords were still blocked by this flame explosion, who was clearly only wearing a cloak. Mo Yuan was very dumbfounded. He felt that his worldview had been shattered. Why was this mage's constitution so high? This did not make sense. In this short period of time, Lin Xian had already quickly drawn up a plan. This sudden encounter with manager number three had completely exceeded his expectations. Given manager number three's attributes, he did not expect that he could kill the other party easily. Therefore, his current goal was, to retreat. However, manager number three would definitely not let him go. It had to be known that his current identity was, Flame Explosion. He had killed Luo Riksu, who manager number three valued the most. If he could not avenge his trusted martial artist, manager number three would definitely lose face. Be it for himself or the germinal organization, manager number three would definitely chase him to the ends of the earth. Dot therefore, if Lin Xian wanted to retreat, he had to first defeat manager number three. A heavy magic book suddenly stretched out from under the black cloak. The surface of the book was made of crimson metal, and flames blossomed around it. The magic book opened by itself, and there seemed to be fire sprites jumping between the pages. Peerless Golden Equipment, Blazing Fire Codex This equipment provided Lin Xian with 5 points of spirit and could also increase his magic power recovery speed by 15%, 0.1% magic consumption with fire spells, and 60% fire magic damage. Then, Lin Xian used his skill, Demon King of Fury. This skill first had a passive effect. Even if it was not used, the effect would still exist. In other words, it would permanently increase fire damage by 15%, permanently increase fire resistance by 15%, and permanently increase 100 magic power. In addition, after consuming 40% of one's magic power to activate this skill, one's fire damage could be increased by 40% again. In addition, Lin Xian had previously obtained the fire flower in the demon ant nest. That attribute item also increased fire damage, which also gave him an additional 10% fire damage. In the end, he also wore a demon flame set dropped from the fourth realm mystic realm blazing fire planes. The set effect provided another 20% fire damage. This stacked up to 145% fire damage. Flame Explosion a huge fireball more than 6 meters in diameter quickly condensed as the blazing fire codex flipped. The terrifying heat emitted by the fireball even made the fake beard that manager number 3 had stuck under his nose burn slightly. Manager number 3's expression instantly changed. Even before he was hit by this flame explosion, he had already sensed the terrifying power behind this flame explosion. 
The diameter of the fireball was more than 6 meters, but the damage range was far greater than that. He knew this because of the combat experience he had naturally obtained after experiencing many battles. He knew that he had to avoid it. Manager number 3's 389 points of agility provided him with a high movement speed. However, even so, it would still take him at least half a second to rush out of the range of flame explosion. However, it took Lin Xian far less than half a second to completely condense flame explosion. Almost the moment manager number 3 turned around and escaped, flame explosion had already been completely formed. The next moment, the huge fireball quickly and resolutely smashed towards manager number 3. In the wilderness enveloped by the night sky, it was as if a small sun had risen, illuminating everything in the surroundings. Manager number 1, who was resting, suddenly rolled over and stood up. Even when he was resting, his passive skill, wide domain perception, was still in an activated state. The energy level of this flame explosion far surpassed the threshold he had set for this skill. Therefore, he was instantly awoken. A battle energy level only inferior to a seventh realm martial artist. Manager number one wore thin pajamas and rushed to the balcony in his slippers. He immediately saw the huge fireball that was rising and had a diameter of more than six meters. He also saw manager number three run away resolutely under the fireball. Further away from Lin Xian and manager number three's battleground, manager number two and Black were running over. However, after seeing the fireball, Black immediately pulled him back. It seems that we don't need to go over. Number two was dumbfounded. As a martial artist who had learned all four elemental spells and was dedicated to walking further and further on the path of a mage, he knew better than anyone how shocking this flame explosion was. If he used flame explosion at full strength, the diameter would at most be four meters. It would not even reach six meters. Boom. It was as if a cannonball had directly burrowed into the ground. The soil instantly blasted into the sky and rushed to a height of 15 meters. Violent tremors immediately spread and quickly woke up the refugees in the shack outside the germinal base, as well as the wasteland reclaimers and fighters in the dormitory. In this post-apocalyptic world, very few people could sleep soundly. Therefore, everyone involuntarily walked out and looked at the ferocious firelight that was slowly rising in the distance. Oh my god, bang. Manager number three's back was brushed by flame explosion. The clothes on his back were instantly burned, and a large portion of his skin was also burnt to a crisp. His entire body seemed to have suffered the impact of the gigantic flame directly and was immediately sent flying more than ten meters away spitting out a mouthful of blood in the air. His health points directly decreased by 1.6. This was only after he was hit by the edge of flame explosion. If he did not dodge, manager number 3 guessed that he would lose at least half to 2 thirds of his health points. Mo Yuan, who was hiding behind the rock, was not affected by the killing range of flame explosion, but his head was buzzing from the shock. His eyes were also burned by the incomparably bright light in that instant. Even when he closed his eyes, he could still see a ball of light swaying around. Manager number three looked back at the spot the other party was standing at. However, at this moment, the cloaked figure had long disappeared from his spot. Chapter 55 Is Flame Explosion One of Us? You are listening at NovelFull.audio Chapter 55 Is Flame Explosion One of Us? Manager number 3 endured the pain and immediately got up. He used the poison frost blade and was prepared to attack if the cloaked man pounced over. He had never used his strongest skill, bloodthirsty assault. He had not used it at the beginning because he felt that it was not worth using to kill a fire mage. However, he had to use it now. If the other party pounced over, he would have no choice but to use this skill to fight. After activating this skill, he would obtain a 15% highest attribute enhancement, an additional 20% critical hit chance, an additional 20% movement speed, 90% additional critical damage, and 70% life, steal. 
his agility would immediately increase to 447. Since Flame Explosion had used such a powerful Flame Explosion skill, the other party should only be able to use Fireball, Fire Ring technique, and other skills. These skills would not be able to cause high damage. However, he was wrong. The other party had disappeared. Instead of pouncing over to take his life when he had been injured, the other party had turned around and run. Manager number three looked around in confusion. He did not feel anything. This meant that there were really no enemies nearby. Ran away. Mo Yuan's eyes and ears were still buzzing. Manager number three put away the poison frost blade and frowned deeply. At this moment, footsteps sounded from afar. We're here to provide support. Manager number two and Black arrived one after another. Number two hurriedly threw a bottle of the great health potion to manager number three. Number three did not refuse and drank it immediately. The skin on his back that had been charred quickly began to recover. The dead skin fell off, and young pink skin took its place. Was it that flame explosion? asked number two. Number three nodded. You couldn't kill him. Black smiled spuriously. The veins on number three's forehead throbbed, but he could only nod. He could not lie and say that he had chased away flame explosion. Black shrugged and said, This small East Lake City is really filled with crouching tigers and hidden dragons. I'm afraid you guys have far underestimated that guy called Flame Explosion. Manager number two sighed. I previously thought that he was around level four sixth realm. Now, it seems that he's at least level seven sixth realm. An expert with such strength is definitely not a lone wolf. He's undoubtedly nurtured by the construction division, manager number three said coldly. Manager number two nodded. Indeed. Number three said, we have to attack White Crane Town ahead of time. Otherwise, this flame explosion will cause trouble again and again. That will be a huge hidden danger for us. Number two nodded. What you say also makes sense. However, this matter still needs to be discussed through the night. We'll need to see what number one has to say. The entire germinal base did not sleep at all. Everyone was enthusiastically discussing the fierce fire in the wilderness. Flame explosion. It was very likely flame explosion that killed Luo Rixu last night. When they saw manager number two, Black, and the others return empty. Handed, they were even more shocked. Was this flame explosion really that impressive? The managers had all been mobilized but were still unable to capture him. Soon, in the highest floor of the germinal organization, an intense discussion immediately began in manager number one's office. The sudden appearance of flame explosion surprised the three managers. This person was too ferocious. Manager number three rarely lost to martial artists of the same level, but he actually failed to win this time. He could only watch as the other party escaped. It could be imagined that the consequences would be unthinkable if the one facing flame explosion was not manager number three but those newly advanced sixth realm or fifth realm martial artists. These people would probably die after being hit by a few flame explosions. Since he appeared at this time, he must have been sent by the construction division to destroy our germinal organization. My idea is to cut the Gordian knot and take down White Crane Town first before dealing with flame explosion, manager number three said solemnly. Manager number two said, but what if we get attacked by flame explosion in the process of attacking White Crane Town? Our team members are already so stretched out, and it's ultimately difficult for us to take care of everything. I think we should take things slow and wait a little longer to increase the number of sixth realm martial artists. He was naturally referring to those level 9 5th realm martial artists who had no hope of advancing perfectly. These people could not beat the experienced mystic realm kings anyway. The faster they advanced, the better. If they could increase the number of 6th realm martial artists, their odds of winning would also increase. After all, if one 6th realm expert could not defeat flame explosion, they should be able to do it with two or three 6th realm experts, right? 
Four or five fifth realm experts would be enough to make flame explosion hesitate to attack, right? No. The longer we delay, the more disadvantageous it will be for us. What if the construction division gets a chance to catch their breath in the battle against the drowning city mystic realm and turns around to deal with us? Manager number three suddenly slapped the table. B. Novcom manager number two also immediately retorted, we don't have enough logistics and combat strength. Do you think the members of the construction division in White Crane Town are all targets waiting to be killed by you? The two of them were arguing fiercely. Manager number one simply had his back facing them as he looked at the black wilderness outside the glass. In the end, the two of them were done arguing and looked at number one. Number one, tell us your decision. I can't be bothered to waste my breath on this guy, number three said unhappily. Number one tapped the table lightly. Let's wait another day. Our reinforcements will arrive then. Manager number two's gaze immediately turned sharp. Reinforcements. Yes, the headquarters sent two seventh realm martial artists, manager number one said calmly. With black, we will have a total of three genuine seventh realm martial artists. And according to the report from the informant planted in White Crane Town, there is only one seventh realm martial artist in White Crane Town. In addition, the headquarters also said that the construction division will be in a battle with the drowning city demon beasts for at least five years. Their members will constantly be invested into the front line and they won't be able to care about the rear at all. After we take down White Crane Town, not only will we not have to worry about the retaliation of the construction division, but we can also use White Crane Town as a springboard to continue attacking the other cities under the control of the construction division. Manager number two's heart skipped a beat. The headquarters that rarely made a move was actually about to make a move. Manager number two knew very little about this headquarters. He only knew that manager number one had been sent to the vicinity of East Lake City by the Germinal organization's headquarters. In the past, when the construction division was still low on manpower, he had seized East Lake City in one fell swoop and established the Germinal organization base here. In other words, manager number one was the true direct descendant of the Germinal organization. Number two and number three had only joined the Germinal organization after this. Manager number two was excited. Beautiful. I knew the headquarters would definitely make a move. Go back and rest. The battle is about to start. Manager number one smiled. After walking out of the office and returning to his office, manager number two's expression immediately became solemn. Black picked up the cup and drank it. After drinking it, he said somewhat angrily, why is this wine tasteless? Manager number two. That's water. With a, oh, he took out a bottle of Red Star Urgoto from the inner shelf and drank it heavily. Is flame explosion one of us? Manager number two could not help but ask. Black. I'm just a bodyguard. Why the hell would you ask me that? Manager number two paced for a long time and could not help but ask, then why is the Germinal organization headquarters willing to send two seventh realm martial artists here? If you ask again, I'll punch you, Black said angrily. Manager number two laughed dryly. I'm thinking about how to pass this information to them. Am I supposed to get Lu Luo to go again? Won't that increase the risk of exposure? Hey, don't hit me. I was only asking myself. Ouch. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Black finished Red Star's Urgoto in one breath. Shield Ghost, try going to him. Chapter 56 Secret Manipulation, Inferior Demon Mountain Demon Beast Surging Out of the Door of Light You Are Listening at Novel Full. Audio. Chapter 56 Secret Manipulation, Inferior Demon Mountain Demon Beast Surging Out of the Door of Light in an Abandoned House in East Lake City, Lin Xian, who was wearing Shield Ghost's equipment, asked curiously, Do you want me to go to White Crane Town to deliver the information? Standing in front of him was a petite figure with a high ponytail and a small suit. It was Lu Luo. Lu Luo had a helpless expression. I can't leave the base easily. 
It's very easy for me to be discovered. After thinking about it, it's best for an intern like you to deliver information. Lin Xian was about to shake his head on the spot. What a joke. So what if it's easy for you to get discovered? Ever since he fought manager number three last night with the identity of flame explosion, it was obvious that the germinal organization would definitely increase the patrol strength. Manager number one's vast regional perception might be even more detailed. It was very likely that manager number one would be able to clearly see everyone enter and leave. BVEC before Lin Xian could speak, Lu Luo took out a letter. Number two has already written a recommendation letter for you. As long as you reach White Crane Town, you can directly enter the mystic realm of White Crane Town with this letter. There's a sixth realm mystic realm there. Lin Xian's eyes lit up. If he could go to the sixth realm mystic realm, he could possess a new training avatar there. He took the recommendation letter. As an intern of the construction division, it's my responsibility to pass information. Lu Luo dug in the storage compartment and handed over a rune. This is the Scarlet Wave Rush rune you wanted. Lin Xian nodded repeatedly. This was the mission reward that Number 2 had promised him previously. The three runes happened to form a rune group. In this way, he could activate the full effect of this rune group. The three effects of Scarlet Wave Rush were plus 20% upper limit magic power, 15% fire resistance by fire magic, and 10% chance of disregarding 100% fire resistance. Disregarding the opponent's resistance was basically equivalent to increasing one's fire damage. Lu Luo took out another note and stuffed it over. This is the codeword for you to contact the 7th Realm Martial Artist from White Crane Town. Finally, Lin Xian asked a question, are 7th Realm Martial Artists really that powerful? Lu Luo nodded. The suppression effect of a 7th Realm Martial Artist on a 6th Realm Martial Artist is very powerful. You'll only be considered to have a profession when you reach the 7th Realm. If you really want to know, you can find Black after sending the information back. He can explain it better than me. Profession Lin Xian was filled with anticipation. At night, Lin Xian casually found an abandoned house and used his skill avatar technique. Soon, a bright Lin Xian appeared in front of him. He took out the most ordinary equipment from his consciousness space and equipped them on his avatar. Then, he put on the giant shield set inside and the stronghold set outside. The appearance of the stronghold set was huge and hard like a muscular man. It was completely different from the refined, long, and full dot armored warrior image of Shield Ghost. Finally, he did something crucial. He changed his training strategy for his avatars in the inferior demon mountain in the fifth realm to take the initiative to attack. After he became a sixth realm martial artist, the limit of avatars became seven. Later, he found another time to go to the inferior demon mountain to possess the corpse of a demon beast. If 7 level 9 5th realm demon beasts took the initiative to attack, it would definitely cause other demon beasts to flee everywhere. These fleeing demon beasts would inevitably cause chaos in the mystic realm. It was even possible for them to rush out of the mystic realm. The lethality of a large number of 5th realm demon beasts was not something that a dozen 5th realm martial artists could resist. If the germinal organization wanted to stop these violent demon beasts, they had to send the sixth realm martial artists over. The bold plan has begun. Lin Xian changed the training strategy of his seven avatars and waited for the right opportunity. Inferior Demon Mountain Yang Wei spat out a large mouthful of blood with a dispirited expression. The three people beside him also shook their heads repeatedly, their bodies injured to varying degrees. They had failed to challenge the Mystic Realm King. They came very close to winning and the Mystic Realm King was injured to the point that it only had more than 400 health points left. However, Yang Wei and the other three had also consumed all the life potions. If they continued to fight, they might be able to kill the Mystic Realm Kings. However, it was also possible for their members to die. 
However, the four of them did not have a particularly firm relationship. This team had only been established for less than a day. They each had their own plans and did not want to take the risk. In this way, when facing the severely injured Mystic Realm King, they were forced to retreat step by step. In the end, they had no choice but to escape from the cave. Yang Wei was rather resentful towards these three teammates, but he did not dare to show it on the surface. He only laughed and said, forget it, forget it. Let's rest. Looks like we're done for today. Yang Wei also felt bitter. If his attributes were a little higher, he would have been able to break through the poison resistance of that mystic realm king. Unfortunately, he was still not strong enough. At this moment, the four of them suddenly heard continuous roars from the foot of the mountain. The other fifth realm martial artists who were queuing in front of the cave also instinctively turned around and looked down the mountain. What happened? Boom. 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 Trees fell and mountain rocks shattered. A large number of demon beasts ran as if they were running from something terrifying. A few martial artists who had just advanced to first level fifth realm were training in the lower levels of the inferior demon mountain. At this moment, they did not even have time to react and were instantly stepped into meat paste by the demon beasts that were fleeing everywhere. When Xiong and Lu Luo were relatively close to the peak and felt that something was wrong, they hurriedly ran to the peak. Even if these demon beasts ran everywhere, they still did not dare to go to the peak. This was because the peak of the mountain was the cave of a mystic realm king. They did not dare to go there. Why is this happening? Yang Wei was very stunned. Logically speaking, when the mystic realm suddenly changed, manager number one would immediately release the news and send it to every martial artist through the broadcast of the mystic realm's safety station. However, there had been zero announcements. Could it be that manager number one failed to realize this? Zhang Peng's eyes were sharp as he pointed at a certain place at the foot of the mountain and said, Look, I think there are a few especially powerful demon beasts chasing after the other demon beasts. Everyone hurriedly looked over and indeed saw a demon blood python rampage. Everywhere it passed, all the demon beasts were swallowed. There's one over there too. There's a demon blood tiger currently hunting other demon beasts. I'm afraid they're the ones who caused the other demon beasts to fearfully run around everywhere. When Xiong also discovered a ferocious demon blood tiger. Soon, the martial artists also discovered other demon beasts. After casting an observer skill, they saw that these demon beasts were all level 9 5th realm. Moreover, their attributes were higher than ordinary level 9 5th realm demon beasts. They were the ones who were attacking everywhere, causing these demon beasts in the inferior demon mountain to become so chaotic. Lu Luo suddenly said, they seem to be heading towards the entrance of the mystic realm, the martial artists' hearts turned solemn as they looked into the distance. Under the hunt, the demon beasts had no choice but to escape downwards. Finally, they arrived at the door of light and directly rushed out. This is bad. That's a large number of fifth realm demon beasts. Yang Wei muttered. An urgent and ear-piercing alarm immediately sounded in the germinal base. Fifth realm demon beasts are surging out of the inferior demon mountain mystic realm. I repeat. Fifth realm demon beasts are surging out of the inferior demon mountain mystic realm. All fifth realm and sixth realm martial artists should immediately rush to support. Manager number one's anxious voice suddenly sounded from the radio. Manager number two was working diligently when he heard the broadcast and immediately jumped out of his chair. I didn't know it was possible for the demon beasts in the mystic realm of the inferior demon mountain to rush out of the door of light. Don't they only rush out when they reproduce too much? But demon beasts in the inferior demon mountain have never reproduced excessively. That's why we always had to kill them collectively every once in a while to control the number of demon beasts, he rubbed his sleeping face and looked puzzled. Chapter 57 Arriving at White Crane Town you are listening at novelfull.audio. 
Chapter 57 Arriving at White Crane Town in an abandoned house somewhere, the radio also sounded. Lin Xian was overjoyed. The appearance of the fifth realm demon beasts from the inferior demon mountain will definitely cause chaos in the germinal organization base. It's time to deliver the information. Lin Xian patted his avatar. The next moment, two figures rushed out of the abandoned house from both sides and ran north. Even in his armor, Lin Xian's speed was still very fast. In just a minute, he had already crossed more than 500 meters. The equipment on his avatar was even lighter, allowing his avatar to travel even faster. In manager number one's office, the white dot haired number one's eyes suddenly turned sharp. He suddenly got up and stood on the balcony, looking at the wilderness in the distance that was enveloped by the night. Under the broad perception of the region, the night seemed to not exist. He could see the stacked buildings under his feet. He could also see the demon beasts killing the weak wasteland reclaimers as well as the martial artists surging out from various dormitories to save the situation. Further away, he saw the hungry and cold refugees in the shack outside the base. At this moment, a young refugee girl was too hungry and fainted. Number one did not stop for a moment as his gaze continued to move forward. He saw two figures running north at high speed under the night sky. In the past, he would not have stopped them. This was because there were such people almost every night. The refugees only knew that there was a construction division in the north, but they did not know how far the construction division was from the germinal organization base. They fantasized about crossing the wilderness at night, but they did not know that the wilderness was not a place where weak martial artists could casually advance. In the past, Number One would not have cared at all and had allowed these stupid people to advance, allowing them to go wherever they wanted. However, now, when the germinal organization was about to attack White Crane Town, he needed to be vigilant of anyone who ran out of the germinal base. Manager Number One had long known that there might be a spy in the germinal organization base, a spy from the construction division. This was the information provided by the germinal spy in White Crane Town. However, he could not find out who this person was. Number three, please capture them for me. Number one grabbed the communicator beside the table and said in a deep voice. Manager number three was currently busy saving the martial artists. After hearing manager number one's description, he immediately turned around and left, allowing the martial artists beside him to be crazily slaughtered by the fifth realm demon beasts. Compared to stopping the fifth realm demon beast, it was clearly more important to capture the two possible spies. Manager number three quickly advanced. The night wind cut the hair on his face like a knife. He was very fast and covered more than 30 meters in a second. Soon, when the tall shadow of the ruined white water city appeared in front of him, he saw the two figures. Lin Xian frowned slightly. Could it be? The germinal organization was so chaotic, but they still had to send manager number three to catch possible spies. What if the two of us were only refugees that wanted to travel to the construction division to seek out a good life? We'll split into two directions. Let's see how you choose. Lin Xian controlled his avatar to get away from him. His main body and avatar split into two directions and entered the ruined city from both sides, disappearing instantly like a drop of water fusing into the sea. Manager number three did not stop at all. He rubbed his skill and also formed an avatar. Lin Xian cursed. Damn, this guy also learned the avatar technique. He just did not know what level and grade manager number three's avatar technique was. However, Lin Xian realized that manager number three probably wouldn't bother investing into the avatar technique. At most, his avatar technique was only at the precious purple grade. Because the avatar technique, observer technique, weaken, disguise, and perception were almost useless in battle, very few people were willing to learn them, let alone invest precious experience points. Seeing that the one chasing after him was manager number three's avatar, Lin Xian immediately smiled and steadied himself. He immediately increased his speed and rushed north. 
His avatar had already seen White Crane Town from afar, so he had long thought of the fastest path to White Crane Town. At this moment, his main body and avatar could quickly circle around every bus and fallen tree in this ruined city and accurately shorten the distance through small alleys. In this aspect, manager number three was inferior to him. Number three sensed that the distance was difficult to close and immediately became solemn. It was simply impossible for an ordinary refugee to be so agile. Manager number one was right. The other party was probably a spy sent by the construction division to the germinal organization. This time, he was probably delivering information to the construction division. Number three immediately activated his skill, wind walk, and his movement speed increased by 50%. This was also one of the skills Lin Xian had failed to detect with his observer skill. Sensing manager number three's speed increase, Lin Xian was not too surprised. After all, the other party was one of the people with the highest positions in the germinal organization. He was a level 9 6th realm martial artist. It would be strange if he did not even have such a trump card. Seconds and minutes passed. Lin Xian finally saw the thick outline of White Crane Town under the night sky. At this moment, manager number 3's main body was already within 10 meters of Lin Xian's avatar. This distance was already enough for him to attack. Manager number three directly used a slide shovel to destroy Lin Xian's avatar in one hit. Then, he quickly placed the poison frost blade on his neck. However, before he could ask, Lin Xian's avatar quickly disappeared, leaving behind the ordinary white equipment. Manager number three was stunned. The other party had actually learned the avatar technique. This skill was not as unpopular as Weaken, but learning another skill like this meant that one would need to spend a lot of additional experience points. An ordinary martial artist would not even have time to advance their own cultivation. How could they care about a skill that did not have much combat strength? My avatar can still catch up to him. Manager number three sat down and focused on controlling his avatar. Lin Xian casually condensed an icicle skill and smashed it towards his back. Manager number three's avatar suddenly dodged. However, just as he dodged, another five to six icicles attacked him. Among the four types of elemental spells, fire spells focused on direct damage alone, lightning spells focused on group damage, poison spells focused on continuous health reduction, and frost spells focused on causing negative status. To be more precise, they focused on the causing negative status of speed reduction and frost. Number 3's avatar did not expect this. After receiving two icicles, its speed immediately decreased by 10%. It was this small difference that made the distance between the two increase. Now, they had already entered the warning range of White Crane Town. Manager number 3 did not continue forward. If he continued forward, he would attract the seventh realm martial artist in White Crane Town to support the other party. He believed that he did not have the ability to defeat a seventh realm martial artist. Manager number three looked deeply at the iron dot skin figure and disappeared into the night. Stop. Who are you? A loud roar sounded from the city wall of White Crane Town. Lin Xian raised his hands. Refugee, I was lucky enough to escape from the germinal organization. The door opened slightly and two soldiers in armor walked out, staring at Lin Xian suspiciously. The germinal base is more than a hundred kilometers away. How did you get here? Lin Xian scratched his head. I walked here with my feet. The two of them. Please follow us to the temporary resettlement point first. We want to ask you a comprehensive list of questions. Lin Xian shook his head. That's naturally not a problem. However, if we delay such an important matter, you won't be able to bear the consequences. I suggest that you let me speak directly to the mayor, dot after all, number three had seen him arrive at White Crane Town. It was impossible for manager number one to not react after finding out about this. It was very likely for the battle date to be brought forward. Chapter 58 Strange Codeword, 
entering the sixth realm mystic realm you are listening at novelfull.audio. Chapter 58 Strange Codeword, Entering the Sixth Realm Mystic Realm The two soldiers looked at each other and immediately changed their attitudes, not daring to delay. Come with us. The two soldiers stared at Lin Xian from the left and right, leading him forward. From time to time, they would sweep him with vigilant eyes. Lin Xian could not blame them. Since he was an outsider, it was very normal for them to be on guard. If these two soldiers ignored him, then there would really be a problem. Lin Xian casually looked around and could see the situation inside White Crane Town. The streets were clean and the houses were neat. There were no sloppy refugees outside the houses. After taking a few more steps, he saw a woman carrying hot food to the city wall and distributing the food to every soldier. Amidst the hot air were everyone's happy and friendly faces. It had been a long time since Lin Xian had seen something like this after having transmigrated to this world. Soon, the soldier led Lin Xian to a low house in the center of the town. Knock, knock, knock. The soldier knocked uneasily. A hoarse and dignified neutral voice sounded from within. What's the matter? Mayor, someone from the germinal organization said that they have important information for you. No, the neutral voice refused. Lin Xian whispered, red snake hand, yellow vine wine. The door was silent for a moment before replying, two yellow orioles. Lin Xian continued, thinking of Gong Jin's past, when Xiao Xiao first got married. Inside the door. You're making me unhappy. Lin Xian said, I'm a bird in heaven. The sound of a chair being pushed suddenly sounded from inside the door, followed by light footsteps. Everyone flies when disaster strikes. Then, the door opened. What appeared in front of Lin Xian was a tall and slender woman. She was in her twenties, had short hair that reached her shoulders, phoenix eyes, and black eye shadows that flew wantonly towards her temples. She also wore a small white suit on her upper body and white leg jeans on her lower body. A.A.S. Her face was angular and valiant, and she had a terrifyingly dignified beauty. Be it men or women, they would instinctively be afraid of her aura and want to get closer to her from the bottom of their hearts. You guys can go back. The woman waved her hand. The two soldiers nodded and turned to leave. Follow me in. The woman returned to her seat and signaled for Lin Xian to close the door. The woman made herself a cup of tea and brewed another cup for Lin Xian before pushing it in front of him and saying indifferently, My name is Yi Yuqiu, the mayor of White Crane Town. How do you know the secret codework of our construction division's veteran member, Silver Fox? Silver Fox was manager number two. That was his code name in the construction division. Lin Xian sat down in front of her. Because I'm an intern from the construction division. Yi Yuqiu took a sip of tea. Where's the thing? Lin Xian took out a recommendation letter and handed it over. Yi Yuqiu opened the envelope and quickly browsed through it before nodding slightly. I understand. Thank you for delivering the information. The letter also mentioned that you want to enter the sixth realm mystic realm that we control. Take this thing and find the person in charge of the mystic realm. You get four hours in the mystic realm. Yi Yuqiu tore off a piece of paper and wrote a few short words before handing it to Lin Xian. Lin Xian looked at the flamboyant scribbles and was very speechless. Were you a doctor in the past? Yi Yuqiu raised her flying sword dot like eyebrows and did not say anything. Lin Xian waved his hand. Never mind. I'm going to the mystic realm. Dot he held the note and pushed open the door and walked out without delay. Yi Yuqiu crossed her slender fingers in front of her and muttered to herself, hmm. For you to value this person so much. What kind of talent does he have that's worth you taking him so seriously? After a short moment of thought, she no longer thought about it. Instead, she looked at the content of the note and tapped the table lightly, as if she was making a difficult decision. 
it's impossible for another seventh realm martial artist to be transferred from the vicinity. I can only, Lin Xian casually pulled someone to ask for the location of the Mystic Realm's door of light and quickly arrived at the northern side of White Crane Town without any obstructions. Here, he saw a six-dot-meter dot tall door of light. Beside the door of light was a security pavilion. In the security pavilion was a stooped old man who was working at this moment, snoring loudly. Lin Xian knocked on the glass to wake the old man. The old man's face was ordinary, and there were ravine dot like wrinkles running down his face. The most memorable thing about the other party was his big nose. After handing over the note, the big dot nosed old man frowned. Young man, this mystic realm is filled with poison. If you don't have a higher poison resistance, it's best not to enter. With that said, he suddenly changed the topic and revealed a cunning expression. He winked and said, I'll sell you a set with high poison resistance here. You can exchange for it with just two pieces of precious purple equipment. Lin Xian could not help but laugh. Grandpa, don't worry. I'm fine. The old man's smile immediately disappeared as he snorted. Then go in. After watching Lin Xian enter, the old man picked up his communicator and made a call. Hey, Xiao Chiu, that brat didn't listen to my advice and didn't buy my set. He directly entered. A neutral voice sounded from the communicator. Uncle, help me keep an eye on him. Silver Fox has specially asked us to protect him. Don't let him die inside. The old man was shocked. Strange, why would Silver Fox specifically ask for us to protect such a person? He doesn't seem very powerful. The old man slowly walked out of the security pavilion and also entered the mystic realm. At the same time, Lin Xian's feet were already standing on solid ground. An intense and stimulating air surged into his nose as dizziness attacked the depths of his mind. Lin Xian hurriedly looked at the data panel and discovered that there was a negative status, miasma poison, on his health bar. The miasma poison was different from the venomous poison and ferocious poison of the poison mosquito swamp. Its effect targeted the brain. However, Lin Xian's poison resistance, venomous poison resistance, and ferocious poison resistance could all be used to resist it. However, the proportions of resistance were different. After being poisoned by the miasma poison, one had a 10% chance of being stunned for one second every one minute. The higher one's constitution was, the lower the chance of being stunned and the lower the duration of dizziness. In addition, after being infected with this miasma poison state, one would also lose 10 health points per second. Of course, Lin Xian could completely ignore this mere 10 points per second. First, his constitution was as high as 353 points, which meant that his basic life recovery speed had reached 35 points per second. Then, he was also equipped with the Fatal Spirit Medicine Rune Group and a Poison Medic set. The first effect of the Fatal Spirit Medicine Rune Group was that life recovery speed plus 70%. Run the Poison Medic set would immediately allow its user to recover 10 health points from any poison attack, which included ordinary poison, venomous poison, ferocious poison, miasma poison, and so on. With the cumulative effects, Lin Xian's health would instead recover more and more when attacked by the miasma poison in the air. It could be said to be a medical miracle. He was basically a humanoid blood machine. Even vampires had to treat him like a mobile canteen. As for the probability of dizziness, in the face of his extremely high constitution, it was completely harmless. Lin Xian directly ignored it. After a short period of discomfort, he quickly adapted. At the same time, the name of this mystic realm appeared in his mind. Poison Miasma Cave, a sixth realm mystic realm. Let's see how deep I can go. I want to set up two training avatars here as soon as possible. I want to increase my martial artist level. Lin Xian strode forward. Although he had the upper hand in the battle with manager number three that night, it was only because he had caught manager number three off guard. 
No one expected that someone who specialized in fire magic would actually be wearing armor and have a very tough physique. Manager number three's 389 points of agility made Lin Xian feel a sense of danger. The difference between a level 1 6th realm expert and a level 9 6th realm expert was a total of 72 points. This gap was too big. He had to quickly make up for it. Chapter 59 Germinal Organization's Early Attack You Are Listening at Novel Full.audio Chapter 59 Germinal Organization's Early Attack The first floor of the Poison Miasma Cave was filled with level 1 6th realm demon beasts. Lin Xian could casually injure these demon beasts with his ice spear technique. Moreover, these demon beasts that lived in the miasma poison cave generally had very low frost resistance. He also discovered that some demon beasts even had negative frost resistance. Lin Xian guessed that it might be because of the low temperature, causing the poison to be less active. After knowing this, Lin Xian strode forward without delay. Every time, he would try his best to choose demon beasts with high attributes and powerful survival skills to act as training avatars. This was because after his training avatar died, he had to come to the mystic realm again to choose a new one. It was naturally the same for him this time. He could not casually pick one. The big dot-nosed old man followed behind and was slightly surprised. This young man is quite interesting. He really doesn't seem to be afraid of the poison. How high is his poison resistance exactly? Seeing Lin Xian can kill a level 1 6th realm demon by casually smashing out a few fireballs, he was even more surprised. This guy uses magic. Then he probably focuses on spirit. His constitution shouldn't be very high. Half an hour later, Lin Xian arrived at the fourth floor of the Poison Miasma Cave without any obstructions. The number of demon beasts here increased, and at the same time, he was attacked by several sixth realm demon beasts. His health points decreased very quickly. Although he could recover in a few breaths, Lin Xian immediately became vigilant. He could not lose any health points. His life was at stake. He immediately took out the Dragon Hunter shield from his consciousness space. After he advanced to the sixth realm, he had long increased some of the equipment he often used and had upgraded them to first level sixth realm. Bang bang bang. The sixth realm demon beasts collided with the Dragon Hunter shield, each and every one of them crying out in pain, their skin and flesh lacerated. Lin Xian used a few more ice spear techniques from behind the big shield and quickly killed these demon beasts. The big dot-nosed old man was speechless. Was he seeing things? A mage with a shield in one hand. And it was a huge shield. The big shield provided survival ability, and the frost spell provided damage output. This was indeed a good combination. Not bad. Like hell it was. How was it possible for him to have so many attribute points to spend? It could be said that spells and shields were completely unrelated. They were simply not on the same page. The big dot-nosed old man could not help but use an observer skill on him. However, he saw that the name was filled with question marks. The attributes seemed very ordinary. He could only see half of the skills and equipment, but he could not see the grades of the other items. Lin Xian, who was still advancing, suddenly shuddered. Because he had a skill perception, he immediately sensed that someone had used an observer skill on him just now. Lu Luo said that there are spies planted by the germinal organization in White Crane Town. Could they be spies observing me secretly? Lin Xian immediately slowed down and made an expression as if the poison had entered his body. From time to time, he would cover his mouth and cough. Seeing this, the big dot-nosed old man nodded. That's more like it. This is how a normal person should behave. Just now, he was probably forcing himself to find out how long he could last in the poison. As Lin Xian killed the demon beasts, he carefully sensed all the targets in his surroundings. He vaguely sensed that a figure seemed to be hiding in the cave dozens of meters behind him. 
Lin Xian coughed lightly, as if he was talking to himself. I can't hold on anymore. I have to leave quickly. With that said, he turned around and ran towards the entrance of the poison miasma cave. The big dot nosed old man was smug. Do you regret not buying my poison resistance set? As Lin Xian passed by the cave where the big dot nosed old man was hiding, he immediately took out the Earth Dragon King hammer and attacked the cave wall with his full strength. Boom! The rock wall collapsed, and dust filled the air. The dust cloud blocked the old man's vision, but it did not block Lin Xian's perception. He headed towards the dust and swung the Earth Dragon King hammer in his right hand again. He condensed another ice spear technique in his left hand. The spear was nearly two meters long and as thick as a fist. It flowed with ice. Blue light and emitted cold air. Bang! The old man was caught off guard and was struck in the face. He retreated more than four meters and collided with another rock wall before stopping. Before he could speak, the ice spear technique stabbed at his chest again. Clang! Lin Xian heaved a sigh of relief. The other party was not dead, but he should have subdued him. Then, he heard the sound of ice shattering. Young man, you're not bad. A familiar voice slowly sounded. Then, a hunched figure walked out of the dust. It was the drowsy old man from the security pavilion. Moreover, the other party was not injured at all. The full dot powered attack of his Earth Dragon King hammer and the ice spear technique that pierced his chest were actually unable to injure him. Lin Xian was stunned. The big dot nosed old man's eyes lit up as he tore open his clothes, revealing his firm and bulging chest muscles. It's been a long time since someone injured me. You're really not bad. Lin Xian tried to use his observer skill but could not see any of the attributes. He could only see about 30% of the information, but he still saw some information. A level 9 6th realm martial artist. Grandpa, who the hell are you? The other party clearly did not have any malice towards him. If he did, he could have severely injured him with a backhand attack just now. The big dot nosed old man raised his eyebrows. I'm just an ordinary small security guard. Lin Xian. The security guard of the construction division is a level 9 6th realm martial artist. The big dot nosed old man said, your observer skill level is not low at all. He patted his chest. I was only following behind you to prevent a rash young man like you from dying in the miasma poison cave. The poison here is not ordinary, however, I didn't expect you to actually discover me and even dare to attack me decisively. He laughed loudly. Lin Xian also heaved a sigh of relief. It was good that everything was fine. Since you're completely unafraid of the poison, this old man won't protect you. I still have to go back to work. The big dot nosed old man fixed his clothes and changed back to his stooped figure. He left the poison miasma cave and returned to the security pavilion before taking out his communicator. Hey, little Chio, this brat is stronger than I thought. You didn't see him. This brat crawled all the way to the sixth floor of the miasma poison cave without even resting. Moreover, he also discovered that I was behind him. He thought that I had evil intentions and pretended to leave, but in fact, he was approaching me to attack. The old man laughed. It's rare to see such a decisive, vigilant, and powerful young man. Yi Yuchio nodded slightly. All right, I understand. Then, she paused for a moment and said, Uncle, this person sent news that the Germinal organization's headquarters will be receiving reinforcements. The reinforcements will consist of two Seventh Realm martial artists. The old man was stunned before he chuckled. I understand. It's time for me to work. I'm hanging up. I need to sleep more now that I'm old. After hanging up the communicator, the old man continued to work cautiously. Soon, the thunderous snoring sounded again. Yi Yuchio also quietly hung up the communicator and stared at the air for a long time with a slight sadness in her eyes. 
At the same time, Lin Xian continued to explore downwards and quickly arrived at the sixth floor of the Miasma Poison Cave. Only after arriving here did he feel the pressure from a level 6 sixth realm demon beast. I can't go any lower. I'll choose the demon beasts here. After spending some time, Lin Xian chose a poison miasma python and a giant rock turtle. After dispelling the two training avatars on his side of the inferior demon mountain, he possessed these two demon beasts and made them his new avatars. Current Area Sixth floor of the poison miasma cave, 4,600 general coin per minute, 23,000 experience points per minute, he did not completely remove his training avatar from the inferior demon mountain because he still needed the minerals in the inferior demon mountain. In addition, if he needed to, the training avatar left there could also cause a sudden riot. Seeing that the training in the poison miasma cave had already begun, Lin Xian nodded. It's time to go. At this moment, an ear dot piercing alarm suddenly sounded in the sky above White Crane Town. Demon beasts are attacking. Demon beasts are attacking. Lin Xian sighed. He had indeed killed many demon beasts. However, he had not gone to the south of East Lake City. There were still many demon beasts there. As long as the managers were willing to make a move, they could also spend some time driving them towards White Crane Town. As expected, the germinal organization had acted ahead of time. However, since the construction division had obtained the information from Lin Xian, they were already prepared. The outcome of the battle was still unknown. Chapter 60 I'll protect two walls alone you are listening at novelfull.audio. Chapter 60 I'll protect two walls alone Lin Xian immediately saw the martial artists rush towards the city wall in an orderly manner. They moved in unison and were well dot trained. Clearly, they did not panic because of the sudden attack of the demon beasts. The construction division sure is good at training martial artists. Lin Xian recalled the battle at the east and west city walls of the germinal organization. The wasteland reclaimers of the germinal organization had all rushed up the city wall in a disorderly manner. After more than a dozen people had died, the morale of the wasteland reclaimers had begun to waver. In comparison, whether it was their mental state or their training results, these martial artists from the construction division had surpassed the germinal martial artists. However, Lin Xian also discovered a problem. There were, very few martial artists who headed to the city wall. Lin Xian sighed and said, it's really as Lu Luo said. A large portion of their forces have been mobilized to the coastal area controlled by the construction division to resist the demon beasts surging out of the drowning city mystic realm. The demon beasts that attacked this time were not powerful. The demon beast with the highest level was only at the third realm. On the city wall of White Crane Town, there were also unmanned defensive towers like the germinal organization's machine gun towers and fire dot breathing towers. These were all things that had been left behind before the demon disaster appeared. They could be used after some repair and modification. With these unmanned towers and the martial artists on the city wall, it only took them more than 30 minutes to annihilate more than 10,000 demon beasts. The martial artists' expressions relaxed as they all walked down the city wall and went out to clean the battlefield to pick up the items dropped by the demon beasts. The martial artists in charge of the logistics hurriedly climbed up the city wall to increase the ammunition for those unmanned defensive towers. However, before they could finish cleaning the battlefield and increasing the ammunition, the ground trembled. In the dark night, it seemed like a large group of shadows was quickly approaching. Come back quickly. The team leader on the city wall immediately shouted anxiously. Fortunately, the demon beasts were still some distance away. These martial artists who had gone out to clean the battlefield returned safely to White Crane Town and closed the heavy door. This time, there were more than 20,000 demon beasts. However, the demon beast with the highest level was still at the third realm. They took more than 50 minutes to win the battle. There were still no casualties in White Crane Town, but the ammunition consumption rate in the unmanned defense tower was very high. 
Dot seeing this situation, Lin Xian had already roughly guessed the strategy of the germinal organization. They wanted to use multiple batches of low dot level demon beasts to attack White Crane Town in order to achieve the effect of exhausting the many martial artists in White Crane Town. If such a harassment strategy was used a few more times, the martial artists would not be able to endure it. Lin Xian could tell, and so could Mayor Yi Yuqiu. Under Yi Yuqiu's order, the few martial artists were divided into three groups. One group guarded the south wall, the second group rested, and the third group prepared. At the same time, in the vast wilderness, manager number one, manager number two, and manager number three were gathered. Behind them was a large number of sixth realm, fifth realm, fourth realm, and third realm martial artists from the germinal organization. The wasteland reclaimers below the second realm were all left in the germinal organization base. In addition, several sixth realm martial artists who had just advanced were left behind to guard the base. The reason why they did not bring the wasteland reclaimers out was because many of the wasteland reclaimers were loyal to the construction division and wanted to live a better life. If they were brought out to fight, they might directly defect to the enemy. Yang Wei, Wen Xiong, Lu Luo, and the others were all already sixth realm martial artists. Yang Wei saw the situation in the distance and could not help but say, Sirs, the effect of the demon beast invasion strategy is not obvious. Is it time for us to attack? Manager number one laughed. No, no, no. Wait a little longer. The time is not ripe. Manager number two asked in a low voice, Number one, didn't you say that two seventh realm martial artists were going to be sent over by the headquarters? Where are they? Without them, we would at most be able to fight evenly with White Crane Town. Manager number one smiled faintly. I can't tell you. I can only wait. Manager number two shook his head. All right. His expression did not change, but he was very anxious internally. He only asked Shield Ghost to provide information to White Crane Town. He only mentioned that the Germinal Organization Headquarters would send two Seventh Realm Martial Artists to the Germinal Base. However, he did not know why the Seventh Realm Martial Artist had not appeared for so long. Shouldn't Number One discuss with the higher dot ups what strategy to use after landing? After a while, Zhang Peng returned. Sir, the number of Martial Artists on the city wall of White Crane Town has decreased. Number One nodded. Drive all the remaining demon beasts there. Yes. Zhang Peng nodded. Layers of running sounds immediately sounded in the darkness, and the ground trembled. Manager number one nodded. Everyone, get ready immediately. Listen to my signal and prepare to attack the three walls in three directions. Yes, everyone replied in a low voice. Manager number two's heart skipped a beat. Damn. Didn't they say that it was a harassment strategy? Why did he let go of the last wave of demon beasts just now? Why would they suddenly split up and attack White Crane Town? Could it be that number one has already discovered that he was a spy? Manager number two was uneasy. Manager number three sensed the subtle expression on his face and doubt rose in his heart. Black Tun drank up a bottle of vodka and patted number two's shoulder fiercely. What's wrong with you? You're so timid. Are you afraid of death? With me by your side, what do you have to fear? Number two almost staggered from being patted and immediately said angrily, My colleagues are still beside me. Give me some face. Number one and number three heard the two of them and immediately smiled knowingly. The doubt on number three's face quickly disappeared. On the other hand, the city wall of White Crane Town immediately fell into a bitter battle. Lin Xian was also stunned. However, he quickly reacted and immediately sensed Manager Number One's sharp strategic tactic. The Demon Beast groups in the first and second wave of Demon Beast attack were quite small, and their levels were not high. It looked like a harassment strategy. 
After that, he waited for the enemy to formulate a corresponding strategy and get the martial artists to fall in three shifts, dividing their troops to guard the city wall. Then, he would directly suppress the enemy by sending all the demon beasts in the third wave. Sensing that more than 100,000 demon beasts had appeared on the south wall facing the germinal organization, the martial artists of the second and third shifts quickly rushed to the city wall. However, they also needed time to get to the city wall. In this short period of time, casualties had already appeared on the city wall of White Crane Town. At the same time, an even more ear. Piercing alarm sounded. Germinal martial artists have appeared on the east wall. Germinal martial artists have appeared on the western city wall. At this moment, Yi Yuqiu had already walked out of her house and arrived at the city wall. She knew better than anyone what the problem of White Crane Town was. There were too few people. Most of the forces had been mobilized to the coastal region to defend against the drowning city demon beasts. There were only 500 plus people left to guard White Crane Town. It was very difficult for more than 500 people to guard the four walls. As a Seventh Realm martial artist, she could not join the battle too soon. Her joining the battle would cause her to be exposed in the open while the other party's Seventh Realm martial artist hid in the dark. The difference between light and dark was obvious. Shield Ghost, Silver Fox has high hopes for you. Can you help guard the east or west wall? Yi Yuqiu said solemnly. She had already known Shield Ghost's character from the letter manager number two had brought. With that said, she immediately said, I'll give you three peerless golden runes of your choice. Lin Xian was overjoyed. All right. Then I'll guard the east and west walls alone. The reward is six peerless golden runes. Yi Yuqiu. Dot. How could he guard two walls alone?